everyone, today we are going to solve supplementary problems in chapter 2, Principles of Hydrostatics. So here we have problem 2-49, a glass U-tube open to the atmosphere at both ends shown in the figure below. If the U-tube contains oil and water, determine the specific gravity of the oil. So let's identify first our given Based on our figure, so here we have the height of oil which is 0.35 meter, the height of water which is 0.30 meter, since we can cancel this one since it has the same height based on the Pascal law, same height and depth with the same type of fluid, regardless of the orientation of the force you will be experienced the same pressure for hydrostatic condition. That's why we cancel this one. So the height of water is only 0.30 meter. Now that we are done identifying our event, we can now proceed in identifying what formula should be used. In our problem, the YouTube contains oil and water, and we need to determine the specific gravity of the oil. So we are going to solve for the pressure of oil and pressure of water. So we are going to use the equation P1 is equals to P2. So we assume that if it is pointing upward, it is negative. And if it is pointing downward, it is positive. Since in our problem, a glass of YouTube open to the atmosphere, therefore it has an atmospheric pressure here. So we're going to make an equation. So here we have this one is the P1. This is P2. Since P1 is pointing downward, this one is cancelled since it is same height and same type of fluid. And P2 is pointing upward. Then we will have um, atmospheric pressure at 1 plus pressure of oil minus pressure of water minus atmospheric pressure at 2, then we can now cancel atmospheric pressure. Then we have um, pressure of oil minus pressure of H2O or water, then transposing it, then we will have an equation of P oil is equals to P water, which is the same with P1 is equals to P2. So we all know that the formula for pressure is specific weight times height. Since specific weight is equal to density times gravity, then we will have density of oil times gravity times height is equal to density of water times gravity times height. And to solve for the density of oil, we are going to use the formula for the specific gravity which is density of fluid over density of liquid wherein the fluid is the oil and the liquid is the water then cross multiplying it we will have density of fluid or density of oil is equals to sg times density of liquid or the density of water and then we will now have the final equation of sg times density of water times gravity times height is equal to density of water times gravity times height. Then substituting the value of our equation, Sg times the density of water, which is 1,000 kg per meter cube, times the gravity, which is 9.81 meter per second squared, times the height of the oil, which is 0.35 meter, is equal to the density of water, which is 1,000 kg per meter cube, times the gravity, which is 9.81 meter per second squared, times the height of the water, which is 0.30 meter, then dividing both sides by 1,000 kg per meter cube, times 9.81 meter per second squared, times 0.35 meter, then we will have now the value for our specific gravity of the oil, which is 0.86.